بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم آئی ایم عمران اینڈ ٹوڈے آئی ایم گوئنگ ٹو ٹیل یو اباؤٹ پاسٹ ٹینس اٹ ہیز فور کائنڈس پاسٹ انڈیفینیٹ ٹینس پاسٹ پرفیکٹ ٹینس پاسٹ کنٹینیوس ٹینس اینڈ پاسٹ پرفیکٹ کنٹینیوس ٹینس So let's start. past tense it has four types number one is past indefinite tense second is past continuous tense third one is past perfect tense and the fourth one and last one is past perfect continuous tense so first of all we will do past indefinite tense or past simple tense past indefinite or past simple tense as i told you we use subject plus verb plus object in a sentence it is also called as s v o s v o s v o construction of a sentence so the example is example of past indefinite tense is i wrote a letter
it is subject it is verb it is object i have used second form of verb in past indefinite tense i wrote a letter example is i wrote a letter write has three forms write wrote and written i have used this second form other examples are i went to university i have used this second form go went gone so i have used this second form i wrote a letter its urdu translation is maine khat likha i did my work maine kaam kiya so urdu examples are likha kiya I went to university main school gaya These are the examples For other pronouns we will use this second form For example he wrote a letter they wrote a letter we wrote a letter she wrote a letter so it is simple past tense now i am going towards second form number 2 is past continuous tense tense its example is i was writing a letter in this sentence i have used subject plus was or for some pronouns we use were plus first form of verb plus i n g plus object i was writing a letter main khat likh raha tha 
सो इट्स उर्दू एग्जाम्पल इज रहा था रही थी रहे थे वी वर गोइंग टू यूनिवर्सिटी वी वर ईटिंग आवर लंच हम खाना खा रहे थे वी वर वॉचिंग टेलीविजन हम टीवी देख रहे थे Now I am going to tell you how we can use this tense with other pronouns. I was writing a letter. He was writing a letter. They were writing a letter you were writing a letter she was writing a letter aslam was was writing a letter uh, with it we also use was it was flowing the water was flowing in the river in this way you can use it now the third one past perfect tense example is i had written a letter i have used subject plus had plus verb third form of verb write wrote written it is third form plus object its urdu translation is i had written a letter maine khat likh liya tha so कुछ दो एग्जाम्पल्स आर लिया था मैं काम कर चुका था आई हैड डन माय वर्क सो चुका था मैंने पढ़ लिया था I had read. I had read. Okay. In this way, you can use. Now I will tell you how to use this sentence or this tense with other pronouns. I had written a letter. he had written a letter they had written a letter 
you had written a letter she had written a letter usne ye khat likh liya tha so it is easy that we have to use this had with all the pronouns so it was third type now the fourth one and the last one past perfect continuous tense i had been writing a letter a letter main khat likhta raha tha i had been going to university main university jata raha tha i had been drinking milk main doodh peeta raha tha in my childhood i had been drinking milk main apne bachpan mein doodh peeta raha tha so it's urdu words are ta raha tha ti rahi thi te rahe the they had been playing cricket वो क्रिकेट खेलते रहे थे नाउ हाउ वी कैन यूज दिस टेंस विद अदर प्रोनाउंस आई हैड बीन राइटिंग अ लेटर दे हैड बीन राइटिंग अ लेटर यू had been writing a letter she had been writing a letter so it was all about past perfect or past tense now i am going to write these four sentences to revise it i wrote a letter i was writing a letter i had written a letter i had been writing a letter it was past indefinite tense it is past continuous tense it is past perfect tense it is past perfect continuous tense in this tense i have used second form in this tense i have used was or with some pronouns we use were and first form of verb plus ing in this tense 
I have used third form of verb. In this tense, I have used subject plus had, had been, with all pronouns. Plus verb, first form of verb plus ing, plus object. Subject plus verb plus object. So it is SVO construction. So it was today's lecture. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you and Allah Hafiz.